Seriously? It's a short paddle. It's not a string game. And it's um, with a plastic ball as opposed to a, a core rubber ball. Pickleball is social and appealing part of the game. Lots of laughter, but competitive spirits lead to getting hurt. I've had two injuries um, playing pickleball. The last one that I had, which was my patella tendon tear in my left knee, uh, was playing in a tournament. Anyone can play pickleball, but 90% of injuries occur in those over 50. One of the common misconceptions about pickleball is that it's less injury provoking than other sports. And most of the injuries that we see occur in the lower extremity, so in the knees and the ankles. They're usually from a sudden lunging, jumping, twisting type of maneuver. Bob's patella injury to his knee was intense. He did sort of a sudden lunge, and what happened was his quadriceps, his thigh muscles, contracted suddenly and actually ripped the tendon from off of the bone just below the kneecap. The first four to six weeks, you're pretty immobile. Then you start to gain confidence and the brace starts to come off because you sleep with a brace for the first five weeks. So how can you keep pickleball fun but safe from strains, sprains, and dislocations? Dr. Roos says warm up, know your limitations, and stretch before and after playing. I'm Marty Salt reporting.